The craze around the return of EA Sports College Football continues. The game has been out for a full week now on pre-release with the official release on Friday. The visuals, gameplay, and school-specific presentations better than ever. And there's a real focus on recruiting. So let's take a look at the top freshman quarterbacks in the game. And this is according to our 24-7 sports rankings. You've likely heard or seen these names across our platforms but you don't have to wait to see them in the fall. You can start building them into your teams today. So, Blair, let's get into some of these top freshmen. And I know you're big into the game. So tell us first, have you started Dynasty play yet? And who are you trying to build here? I'm in an online dynasty with a couple buddies and I'm too lane actually that we drew straws and and so I'm the uh, I'm too lane I'm I'm not doing very well we're playing on all american it's very difficult it's not as easy as as it was or as I remember so maybe I'm just washed up have you gotten a chance to play it grace Blair, I know this may come as a shock, but I am not a gamer. However, if I were, I would choose my alma mater, by Miami, Ohio. There are some good bones there. Uh, I believe in them, and I'll be rooting for anyone who picks them. I'm rooting for you, too. Uh, but it's definitely exciting to see the hype with everyone else tweeting out their videos on Twitter and stuff. But let's get into our top freshman quarterbacks now for the game, and we'll start at number five. It's Demond Williams out of Washington, number 19 overall in the 2024 rankings what do you like about him it's a video game right and it has to be entertaining and it has to be exciting and damon williams with his scrambling ability checks off both of those boxes i, I really love what he's able to do outside the pocket he's a, a dynamic passer and then when you think about what coach jet fish was able to do with noah fafita at arizona to land a four-star prospect in Demond Williams who has a lot of the same characteristics, I think it's going to be really fun to play with him. And if you're building a dynasty with Washington, you can expect him to really continue to develop. And I think from a projection standpoint, when you're thinking about a junior or a senior Demond Williams and you were able to do some of your job as a recruiter, you're going to be able to build a really good roster around him and make it an exciting and fun thing, which is what video games should be about. Yeah, that was definitely entertaining watching that right there. Let's move into number four, Isaac Wilson out of Utah, number 21 overall quarterback in the 2024 rankings. Why do you like him as an EA Sports player? It's his gunslinger mentality. I think it really translates to video games. He's been able to put up crazy video game uh, video game numbers as a high schooler, and, and he's getting a lot of buzz after his performance in the spring game. I think he's going to be able to sit and develop for a year behind Cam Rising. But after that, if you pick Utah and you have Isaac Wilson on that roster, I think you could expect a lot of hardware, uh, a lot of championship game appearances because he's got that moxie as a quarterback. He's able to distribute the football. I really like his arm strength and, and being able to test him out in the video game. It, it really, uh, I think, mirrors what we were able to see during the recruiting process as him as a, a prospect. So I think the upside is tremendous. And, and if you have fun in the Big 12 and you want to put up a lot of points, I think Isaac Wilson's one of those big options. Okay, that's true. Yeah, that is one thing I'm seeing. A lot of points scored in this new version of the game. Moving on to number three, it's Haas Haney out of TCU, the number 12 overall quarterback in the 2024 rankings. What do you like about him? A player we absolutely loved during the recruiting process last year. You see him cradling <laughs> the baby there. Uh, he is going to be a, a player that you, I think, have to be patient with. I don't know if he's completely game ready right now, but I think in two or three years, if you build out a dynasty, uh, a lot of the same things we just said about Demon Williams as a scrambler, as an electric player outside the pocket, as someone that could extend plays with his legs. Haas Haney has a lot of that same moxie. I, I saw him recently at the Steve Clarkson quarterback retreat and, and a lot thicker physically than I remember him. So he's going to be able to uh, pick up some yards down the field and, and really give you that dynamicism that you need to be able to run some RPOs, to run the ball uh, and get the ball out quickly to your receivers in space. Haas Haney checks off those boxes for sure. All right, number two is a guy everyone should know by now, and that's Julian Sayan out of Ohio State, the number three overall quarterback in 2024. Blair, what are you looking forward to seeing from him in the game? I think it's cheating in a way to, <laughs> to pick an Ohio State quarterback, but 
you have to pick him if you want to have fun with some of the weapons that Ohio State has been able to stockpile. Uh, a really surgical passer, really good inside the pocket, has the arm strength to get the ball downfield. And if you're going to be able to recruit the, the skill positions and have your quarterback already on the roster like a Julian saying, I think you can expect to, to be really dominant. Um, they, all, they always have the, the five-star talent around the, the, the quarterback, whether it's at the offensive line and the running back room. Uh, you have a, a Chip Kelly offense now in that game. I think Julian Sain is a really exciting prospect that you can have a lot of fun with for three or four years in dynasty mode. And uh, like I said, it's a bit cheating because of some of the weapons that you have around him, but it is a video game. And if you want to have fun, Julian Sain's going to do that. See, I thought that too, Blair, when I saw Ohio State, but I guess you could get him to transfer to like your Tulane, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, right. absolutely. That's one of those players, right? If he if he isn't on uh, on the roster, is in is he isn't quarterback run right away, and he answers the portal. Keep an eye on Julian Sain as a potential program saver. Mm -hmm. I like this. All right, your top quarterback to play with in the game, Dylan Riola out of Nebraska, our number two overall quarterback in the 2024 rankings. How fun could he be to play with? A ton of fun, big arm talent, maybe the best pure passer in, in that class for 2024. And this is dynasty mode. So you're trying to build out long term. You're trying to turn a program around. Dylan Riola is doing that in, in real life. So why not translate that over to the uh, electronic version and try to uh, lead his, you know, his his legacy program back to the promised land. That was a big part of his recruiting process. A former commit to Georgia, a former commit to Ohio State. He ends up going to the Cornhuskers, a program that that where his where his father played, and and he's in a way viewed as a savior. And so it'd be fun, I think to potentially mirror some of the things that he's going through as a true freshman there in Lincoln and to try to guide that program back to the top. I think it'd be a lot of fun. You do have to recruit players to mm. protect them up front. You have to protect, uh, obviously, the, the prize possession there in the, in the backfield. You need some receivers. You need a running back. Uh, but I think Dylan Riola checks off a, a lot of the boxes that you want as a quarterback, as a true freshman in dynasty mode. Yeah, Nebraska could definitely be an interesting one to see this year in real life and on the game simultaneously. Who comes out with the most wins? We'll see. All right, for more EA Sports College football content and recruiting content, head over to the 24-7 Sports YouTube channel. Our experts keeping you up to date with the latest content every day of the week. We got exclusive interviews, tape breakdowns, commitments. That's all over at 24-7 Sports on the YouTube channel. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.